Fallout 4. Greetings everybody to a brand spanking new Fallout 4 series with your host, Mundy. My god, I am so hyped for this. Oh, let's do this! I'll leave the hype, bitch. The hype is real. Well, here it is, the inevitable <laughs> character customization, which I, I can never seem to control myself with. And I can't seem to make his like eyes ridiculously big or his nose to be like enormous, like this protruding thing. It actually seems like a pretty sensible one for a change. So what kind of presets we got here? Oh my god. There is so much detail to this game now. I can see beard hairs. <laughs> I've never seen these before. Hey, baby. This guy's kind of got the similar hairstyle. I mean, mine's a bit of a mess today, but usually it's it's back like that. He does look rather... I can see a bit of likeness there. Do I, do I seriously look anything like this guy? Probably not, but <laughs> we're going to try and make myself, I guess. We're going to try and make the Monday. I can sculpt eyelids. What the hell is this? What can I actually do with his eyelids? Can I... Oh my god, I can make his eyes really wide. Look at that. I'm watching you, bitch. Oh, babe. Your hand feels so good on my... Oh, oh. I don't want to make eyes. him. That's the reason I said yes when you asked me out. <laughs> really? My eyelids? All right. Whatever floats your boat. I've got to do something about this nose. I mean, my nose, I'm pretty sure, is not as big as this. It's pretty. Oh my goodness. <laughs> we can point it out. <laughs> Babe, have you taken a shit in here? Or is that just your breath? And now it's Ben. What have I done to it? Okay. It's, oh, oh, okay. It's like that. I'm sorry, but my ears are nowhere near as small as this. For some reason, I've got like the saggiest earlobes ever seen. I will freaking kill you. I think I look pretty sexy with blue eyes, but unfortunately, I don't <laughs> have blue eyes. You can make him spotty. This is so weird. I don't know what you're laughing about. You did this to me. The chunky hubby is in the house. I'm obviously going to give myself enormous guns. <laughs> what do you think? Does it look anything like me at all? <laughs> it looks like me on a very tanned and good-looking day, uh, admittedly, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> I think I'm happy now. I've been sat here for hours. Okay, so it looks like we're in a little, uh, futuristic sort of bathroom here. We have an enormous shower. Look at this thing. Nora! Nora, can I... Oh, hello. You've got some serious style going on here. <laughs> yeah, fucking... Yeah, yeah, your pants are nice and high there. Hey, hon. Can I... Just... Why don't you see if breakfast is ready? Well... How would breakfast be ready? You're in here. Don't just smile at me like that. How can you see yourself in there? There's nothing even there. You silly, silly bitch. Look at how pretty it is out there. It does just look like Nuketown, if I'm honest. Honey, I'm horny. <coughs> me so horny. Never gets into the bedroom. I don't know why I bother. Hello, I can hear some shuffling. <gasps> Shawnee boy. Hey, buddy. You have really got a lack of... Blankets in there. Oh, look at him. He's so mobile. Oh, I can play with him. I guess that's all I can do with you. Can I not? <laughs> I can't do anything else with him. I'm just gonna leave him alone. Bye, Sean. I'll be back in a moment with some biscuits. Don't tell your mother. Ah, good morning, sir. Hello. Ooh. Wow. Are you gonna shut up talking already? Well, that's nice. I can't actually see my reflection in you. Obviously, I don't exist. Enjoy your coffee, sir. Where, where is my coffee? What have, you, what have you done with it? Is it up your ass? Ooh, here's my coffee. I'm such a beast, I can just drink it without picking it up. It surprises me because he has a massive saw for a hand. And he can freaking look after a baby, but okay. It's a little early to be drinking. It's never too early to be drinking. That salesman. He comes for you every day. Well, surely if he comes for me every day, you wouldn't need to remind me that he comes for me every day. Nora. Hey, buddy. Good morning. vault -Tec calling. Get your fucking feet away from my doorstep, please. vault -Tec. I look so sexy. <laughs> you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. You're damn right I am. One eleven. Hmm. Enough space, go go away. <laughs> Sounds great. Sounds great. <laughs> I could be Saki. I I'm kind of tempted to see what he's gonna say. No, I can't wait for the world to end. <laughs> <laughs> That's the spirit. Ah, here we are with the special points again. Okay, so I think I'm pretty happy with that. I'm just gonna go for sort of average player this time. I mean, I 
I don't know how the game's going to pan out, so I don't know whether or not having certain things like perception is going to be really important or if having intelligence is going to be really important. Um, but I know the charisma, endurance, and strength are important, so I'm putting the most points on there. And I don't rely on luck for a lot of things, so let's just go for it. Wonderful. Um, yeah, shut up. Thanks again. <laughs> Look at you there. Looking all sexy. Look at those eyes. Just <laughs> evil. How the hell did you change him? <laughs> all right, Codsworth. I'm going, I'm going. I know, I know. You got the robot saw up your ass. Let me, let me play with you a little bit more. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, hello. All right, bitch. Have to listen to you. I know how to look after my own kid. There we go. Ah, oh, nighty night. Much better now, huh? Listen. No, thanks to you. I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. <laughs> and do what? Um, I'd I'd like to go to the park. To be honest, I'm more of an outdoors or doorsy person. So yeah. Yeah, sounds like fun. Yeah. What's he doing out there? Oh Christ. Shawnee boy, sit tight. What are you doing now? Got your medal in a twist. Oh, hey Sean. His little face. Look at him. He's not even breathing. We need to get to the vault now. Oh shit. We gotta move. Oh, I can sprint. Look at this. Yes. Come on, hurry up. Trusting you with my boy here. Get out of the way. Oh, bloody hell. Mate, you're gonna end if you're up dead. Yeah. Step forward, otherwise return home. <laughs> I feel sorry for all these people. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna walk on in here. In. Jesus Christ! Look at that thing. That looks like Master Chief. Come on, let me in. Thank you. Good man. Hey. <laughs> He's getting really mad with me. Oh God. I love you, babe. Oh my God. Oh Jesus. Mr. Reporter Man. Oh god, he's screwed now, isn't he? I bet you any money we're gonna find him at some point in the game. Like like a skeleton or something, like all like janked up. It's gotta be. Find his little hat. <laughs> These people have names now. I can actually Mr. Russell. Mr. Abel. I bet you are able. And look at that ass! Miss Mrs. Abel. Would you look at this place? Up the stairs! You got a funny voice. Oh, fuck you, Mr. Russell. Maybe, maybe, maybe I want to go up the stairs first. Yeah. Dick. He'll show you where to go. All right. Hey, Doc. Follow me. Follow me. You're a nice doctor. You gonna lead the way? Excuse me. Come on. Just this way. Get your ass moving. Oh, you're gonna love it here. Am I? This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. Hmm. Okay. I don't like the look of these things. What the fair? I've got to go in these things? What about my baby, huh? You're going to put him in a freezy chamber? How are you going to fit a baby in here? These are not baby sized. Are you going to get in there or what? I'll take Sean with me. Get your fucking ass in there. I, I want to make sure you're safe. You what? <laughs> okay, all right, whatever. All right, in I go, I suppose. Oh, this looks chilly. Oh, so I'm just staying in here then. I'm not actually... For a whole new life. Okay. Let's get comfy then, I suppose. Hey, babe. I hope Sean's okay. I hope he's comfy over there. Oh. <laughs> okay. Now what is happening? This... You don't you dare touch my Shawnee. He's got a gun. He's got a freaking... No. No, let me out now. Don't you dare drop Sean, you bitch. What are you doing? What are you doing? Don't do this. Oh, let me out of here. This is fucked. This is fucked up. Oh, you've just earned yourself a death sentence, you. You, you bold prick. You're going to die. I remember faces, asshole. Finally, I'm allowed out. Been in there for days. Too late. She's crispy. I gotta find my boy. Shawnee. <coughs> oh my god, there's chambers everywhere, these cryo tubes. Can I take something to defend myself with? I feel kind of vulnerable here. 
Ooh, it's got fucking fists of steel. Ew! One of those little rad roachy things. Look at that. Stim packs. Oh, yeah. I'll take a fucking chair. Oh, with the steel chair. Do I have a weapon or anything to defend myself against that little beast? <laughs> oh, here we go. We got a, we got a baton. Oh, yeah. Come on in, you little bitch. Oh, my God. He's friendly. <laughs> Giant. Little asshole. Giant. Who Oh, that little guy got fried. Okay, so I'm not gonna go through there. Where you going, boy? Oh, you see a bit of this? Oh. Bloody hell, they're feisty little ones, aren't they? Alright. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, suck on that. Oh, yep. Yeah, okay, now. Now I'm feeling much better. <laughs> much better. I have a weapon in my hand. Can I... Ooh. Can I? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. The true iron sights. I love them to pieces. What is this? Coming back later for you. Unlock master. Oh, my God. Oh. All right. Okay. I'll play with this, have I? Oh. Oh, oh shit. Sorry, buddy. You're lazy. So that thing in there is a portable cryolator. I know that's obviously a name of it, but it means it freezes stuff. Oh, mate. I want that. Someone better remind me to come back and get that. Oh, so that's nice. So they were testing to see what would happen if they froze us for years. Gee, thanks. And then people went crazy. They wanted food. And then they decided they wanted to go outside. So they fucking killed this poor guy here. And then they buggered off out, I'm assuming. So... Terminal somewhere. Oh, for God's sake, I thought I did this. I was sat at this computer for long enough. <laughs> there we go. Right, now what's going to be outside here, I say? Uh, obviously, it's going to be more of you guys. Oh, ha, ha. It's so perfect. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh my god. <laughs> he moves quick. Oh man, I'm going to have to get used to that. This, so this is like the first PS4 game I've ever played since I've had the PS4. So it's really weird to have a controller that feels different in my hand because I'm so used to playing Xbox 360. So... Fingers crossed. I'm not going to screw everything up. You were just taking a meal at some bony old guy here. That's pretty... Hey! Go. Oh. Snuck up on me. Oh, so it looks like we can just get out using this thing here. But, uh... Oh, hello. Ooh. My little pip boy. Put on some dead guy's arm. I won't bother to clean it or anything, you know. I'm just going to... Diseases, you know. Can't touch this guy. He's too sexy. <laughs> Did that just say 64k RAM? God, there are so many perks. Look at them all. So this has completely changed. The whole perk system has obviously changed. And we can like <laughs> zoom in on stuff. Look at those guns. Oh yeah. My pit boy is gold. I mean, come on. What other color would it be? Oh, I'm loving this though. Look at this. They brought back the uh, the favorites. Plugged in. Oh, okay. All right. Does that work? This guy knows what he's doing. <laughs> knows a lot more about what he's doing than I do. But yeah, that was the reason why I didn't really enjoy Skyrim as much as perhaps I would have liked to. Is because you lost the whole hotkey function. And every time you wanted to select a different weapon or something, you only had two hotkeys, you know, up or down. And it was a bit of a shame, really, because when I used to play games like Oblivion and Fallout, I used to love the fact that I can just switch weapons halfway through, like, a battle and start using something else, whether it was a melee weapon or whether it was, like, a long-range weapon or anything. And it really made the game flow and it made it fun. But with Skyrim, it sort of lost that. And now I'm, I'm kind of glad they brought it back. <sighs> so here it goes. <laughs> I'm just hoping the gameplay is going to be as good as what I believe it is going to be. Nope, I'm pretty happy with everything. <laughs> so if for some bizarre reason you haven't actually played any Fallout games, seriously, go and do it right now. Um, play them, play this game. They are, seriously, they're one of the best games I've ever played on in my entire life. The one game I could come home from school, switch on, I could play for hours on end. All of the Bethesda games are just amazing. And here we are, we get to see a bit of light now, a bit of the outside. Oh my goodness. <sighs> It's blurry. I need sunglasses. <laughs> wow. This is such a crazy moment for me. I mean, these games are so brilliant. Every single one of them. And I just... Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. Is this the reporter guy? <laughs> oh, I shouldn't be mean to skeletons. Come on. They didn't... They didn't... 
live, you know, being a dick right now. I love how interactive the environment is. You can just move everything. Everything just... <laughs> look at it. You can just shift everything out of the way. Get out of the way. I'm coming through. Okay, I'm kind of afraid at the same time as being really excited because I'm not sure what to expect. I don't know what sort of mutants or creatures they're going to bring back from the old Fallout series and which ones they're not. I deliberately didn't look into all the details about this game because I wanted to keep it a surprise. A lot of people, when a game comes out, they just sort of go into it and they look up every last little detail. I kind of wanted to keep it a surprise so that you guys could see that. You could see that I'm I'm ecstatic to be playing this right now. And is this where I came in? This, this is where I came in. This is where... Maybe this guy's a reporter guy. I don't know. Maybe these guys... <laughs> this is horrible. I'm amazed that these people are all in one piece, though. I was expecting there to be bones and pieces and bits everywhere. Prepare for the future. Yeah, well, you froze my ass. And then you took my baby. And I'm going to find my baby. And I'm going to make that asshole with the red face pay. All right, I don't like people nicking my stuff. Especially not my children. Oh, I can take that. I can tell already there's going to be a whole lot of growing stuff and building stuff and all of that in this game because... Look at this. This is just, this is more like Skyrim, picking up all this stuff and messing about with it. Oh, this was all so pretty before. And now it's all desolate and horrible. Oh, look at this. We have dirty water. Drinking water restores health. Drinking unpurified water causes radiation damage. I'm not going to drink this stuff, I don't think. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave it. Although it looks rather tasty. Blood leaf? There's going to be so many weird things in this game, isn't there? Well, okay, well... Seriously, I'm getting freaked out by the titles popping up, the quest titles. Or is that just... Oh, that's, that's just a location title. Sanctuary. Oh, this is where I lived. <gasps> it does look a lot different, I must admit. Certainly doesn't look like Nuketown anymore. <gasps> Coddy? Coddy? Hey, buddy! Hey! Oh, it's, it's really you. you really are excited to see me. <laughs> What are you doing out here? You pruning bushes? What the fuck? Oh god, you're still here. You're you're still here. This is so heartfelt. I can feel so, it. Man and machine guys. Oh oh no. No 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 no. You just struck a nerve there. You just struck a nerve. They killed her. They killed her. Codsworth, are you high? What are you talking about right now? <laughs> Don't talk about Sean now as well. This guy must have some serious nerve. Have you seen Sean? Nothing makes sense. He's been kidnapped. Sean's been kidnapped. I'm going to get my son back. Damn right. Couldn't have said it better myself. Well, I've been in a fucking cryotube for like 200 years. Well, it better be goddamn well tasty, my friend. Um, <laughs> you okay? <laughs> Get food. Yeah. What? Food? Y yeah, sure. <laughs> the difficulty of successfully persuading someone is indicated by color. Yellow, easy, orange, medium, red, hard. Okay. I need to remember that, definitely. Let's see what this guy's going to cook up for me. I mean, I don't... My house. Look at this. You know what? I actually like the decor a little bit better now. Don't you dare give me fucking sugar bombs. <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> are you okay? I'm gonna have to say that. Codsworth. Are you sure you're holding up okay? <laughs> He's breaking down. Yeah, mate, I know how you feel. I know how you feel. I was in a fucking cryo chamber. Right, come on then. Let's get you out of this house and let's get you into some action. Where is he going? Look at him. He's like, <laughs> all right, okay. I just want to explore at my own pace, but if you want to fly on past, then, you know. Oh my. What the fuck? <laughs> what was that? A bloat fly. What is he? <laughs> what are you doing? Godsworth. Jesus Christ, man. Calm down. <laughs> just... God, he just cut them to pieces. Can you wait here for a second, please? I'll, I'll stay here. I'll just be... I'll just be... What a 
fucking psychopath. Search the neighborhood with Codsworth. I don't know where he's gone. He's got, he's buggered off somewhere. What a dick. Oh, there he is. Look, mate, you're stealing all my kills, all right? You're stealing my thunder. My family isn't here either. No, I, I know. They aren't going to be that easy to find. Yeah, I think you should, to be honest. I cannot keep up with your ass all the time. So just go back and... Go, go, just... Yeah. Oh, looky here. We found a weapons workbench. Where I believe you can craft some stuff. I don't think I have enough things for it, though. Whenever I need to make some upgrades to my weapons, I can just come back here. Um, I need to remember that, really. So wherever this place is on the map... Let's have a quick look at the map, actually. I didn't think to uh, check that out. Um, oh, crikey. Here we are, look. Vault 11, and there's the Sanctuary. And that is where Coddy's telling me to go. So I'll have to check that out at some point. So from the offset, the map does look pretty big, but then again, it's always very deceptive. Like with the Skyrim map, I never knew how big that was going to be. So I'm hoping it's a big map. I'm hoping there's going to be loads of stuff to explore because I, that's the one thing I love about these games is just exploring and finding stuff and finding things that you think no one else would find. But anyways, guys, I think I'm going to wrap the episode up here because this recording has gone on for so long. Honestly, fitting all these bits and pieces in at the beginning of the game is absolutely crazy. And of course, this is the first time I played Fallout 4. So all the character customization and going through the vault and everything, it took a bit of time. But uh, anyways, I'm really, really, really looking forward to this series. This game looks amazing and I'm sure it's going to be an enormous series on the channel but at any rate if you enjoyed today's video remember to watch and the like button and i didn't mean to do that but anyways <laughs> i'll see you guys on the next video see you later